as promised. Good work. I had hoped it would be you who would bring it to me. I would rather not give lockdown the satisfaction of payment a second time. Now. Something that you've seemed to have met yourself with defeat. Now, hook both of us up to one frequency. Sir, with all due respect, are you sure this is safe? Do as I say, imbecile. Y yes, sir. Nothing like that exists, right? Actually, I think I know someone. to disturbances during my work yesterday. Ah, uh, yes. Starscream's brothers came to attack our base, but they were easily dealt with. I see. Which reminds me, any updates on my new body? I feel we waited long enough to pursue Incinerator. Who knows if he found the Allspark yet or not? I have not been procrastinating on the man. Believe me, the Allspark is a priority of the utmost high. However, higher yet is the priority to prepare for Megatron's return from Garrus 9. Why would that matter if the Allspark is already in the hands of someone like Incinerator? Because the nuisance has no idea how to unlock his true secrets. If Incinerator had the Allspark, as you so believe, then all he could do is pump up energy into his own body. But only someone trained can truly slot him. to be back. Oh, who might you be? Scorpana. That's what they call me. But now I am back to serve the Decepticon cause once again. And to that extent, you, Master Shockwave. But I thought you had been killed. I watched Optimus Prime step on you and crush your skull just before I left to face Starscream. I recognize the name, but not the appearance nor your voice. Is this the minion you used as the makeshift doctor long ago, Blackout? Yes. My vocal processors and brain both were damaged shortly after arriving on Earth. But it would seem that I was fortunate to be revived by this Earth native. A human? 
He's the one that has been harboring frenzy for many months, my liege. Now that he has experienced our technology, he wishes to aid us. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Nikolai Vladov. I was a scientist for the United States Science Division known as KSI, a splinter of the rogue military group known as MEC. However, after your friend Skorpinok here destroyed my laboratory, I have since been presumed dead. You are not actually going to allow a human in our base, Shockwave. What could Megatron say? I don't give a damn what Megatron says. The human wishes to help, then he can help. He has some use to me. Let's get him in the cell with the others. Get moving! Long arm? What? Where? What happened? Okay. Long arm, long arm, what's wrong? Are you hurt? Long arm! Silence, Autobot. Your voice is so loud, and we're in this small room. Just chill out. Do you always only care about yourself? Well, I do have a fondness for my brother, Thundercracker. Skywarp, on the other hand, is quite an idiot. He would never be able to survive on his own. But enough about me. It's obvious what's wrong with your friend. Ugh. He's torn up about something. I don't know what it is, and frankly, I'll admit I don't really care. But something must have happened back at your cute little Autobot base. Something bad. Worse than that little catastrophe involving your friend Swerve that you told me about. But who knows? I'm only speculating. you've gone as soft as he has. I will have his head very soon, my lord. And I'm not soft. I am a Decepticon, and I live to serve you. I'll never stab you in the back like Drift did. Do not patronize me, Bludgeon. We are Decepticons. It's on our names. It is very rare to find someone truly loyal to the cause and its masters. Actions of far louder voices and words can ever muster. If you're truly loyal to me, prove it. Of course, my master. Forgive me. It was not my intent to patronize you. It was wrong of me. Hmm, that's of no matter. Drift will soon come back, or you will kill him. 
both are very high possibilities at this point. But know this, you have to be the one to kill Drift, whether he comes back or not. Do this, and your training will be considered complete. Yes, my lord. locked. 